experience like out there, not only for the ceremony, but you scored pretty quick into the game, sell off plays, they're screaming, they're yelling. What was that like for you? That was a lot of fun. Uh, you know, that gets you excited, obviously. Uh, RJ, what a ceremony there. Um, obviously, you know, I haven't been here too long, but you can see what the, he meant to the fans. And, um, you know, that was, it makes you want to win a Stanley Cup, for sure. Uh, have those build, people in the building every night. Um, you know, we're going to win a lot of hockey games. You did sort of the Lambo leap into the glass there. I mean, just how jacked were you guys at the start of that game with that crowd and with the noise? Yeah, like I said, uh, it was electric. Um, <laughs> It was, it was a lot of fun to get that first goal. Um, nice play by Cuzzy, obviously, there. Um, yeah, that was, that was a lot of fun. Does that just give you guys an idea of what you're in store for, you know, when things do change and the fans, and a lot of fans probably are coming back who are in that crowd tonight with the show you guys gave them. Uh, does that give you some hope as you look forward to what can be there? Yeah, definitely. I think, you know, we, we know um, Buffalo has had a, a great fan base for their whole existence um you know obviously we haven't had the most success here in the past but you know we're a young group and we're excited for the future um you know it starts with us and bringing them back for sure and uh, i think that you know this game is, is a start to that and obviously we got a lot of work to do but um no that, that was a lot of fun like i said uh, it makes you you know when playoffs hopefully come come around here soon it's it's going to be electric like the whole night and seeing replays, if you even saw them, of, of like iconic moments in Sabres history. And just the way things ended with the crowd chanting and RJ, and did this give you a flavor of just may, maybe some kind of a, a, a more of an inside depth of what this team is and what this franchise is meant? Yeah. Um, so, you know, some of those those clips are a long time before me. Uh, this, you know, RJ, obviously, uh, it, it was special. Um, you know, it's, they, they've been around, I think, you know, coming from a team that's brand new to now the team that's been here a long time, it's it's really exciting that you know they have that foundation and um, no, it was a lot of fun. Like I said, and seeing those clips from you know all the all the people that have um, that RJ has impacted and um, you know all his great uh, all, all the great things he's done for for this organization, it's uh, it was special. Alex is obviously a long lifelong Sabres fan. What was it like to see him bring RJ out on the ice after the game and be a part of that little? Celebration. Yeah, that was uh, unbelievable. Um, you know, you, you get you get chills, a little t teary eyed for sure. Seeing that, that's uh, that's a special moment, and uh, you want to, you know, have a lot more of those uh, coming up. The comfort you guys have now with late, tight games, late. Just what's gone into making you guys thrive in those situations? Yeah, I think uh, obviously we believe in what Donnie has, has brought forth, and we brought believe in each other as a group. Um, you know, I think uh, we are a younger team, but you know we know that if we put the work in, uh, we can compete in this league. And um, I think from the start of the year to, to now, we've improved a lot in our our late game. Uh, you know, just um, playing the right way, doing the little details to allow us to, you know, um, have success in the games. Why don't you guys look at it? you had the three to one lead, and Nashville got a couple of goals basically because of bounces, yeah. one off the back wall, and it comes back out. They got a tip. How did you guys look at it that, hey, we got a couple of bad breaks there, we're going to be fine? Yeah, definitely. I think, uh, like I said, we have trust in our group to, you know, battle back. Uh, even in, like, Chicago game there, we were, we were down, um, you know, four, and we knew in our group that, you know, we could we could come back, and that's same here. You know, we gave up two quick ones there. No problem. We'll just uh, keep battling and uh, playing the right way. It, it, it'll come. Peyton, RJ told us that he wouldn't just be surprised if you guys didn't make the playoffs next year, that he would be disappointed. Does a night like this help you guys to believe in that too? Yeah, I think obviously it's a, it's a long ways away, but I think we're, we're starting with a good foundation here. Um, you know, and every game we're, we're trying to build into that, um, you know, into next season and, um, you know, for the rest of the – as long as all of us are here, for sure, um, it's exciting. Obviously, uh, RJ, um, you know, he he believes in us, and uh, it's exciting for sure.